Hey everyone, how are you? I am still in Australia until tomorrow and then head to New Zealand. But I had to share that I just had a super fun um, freedom painting session inspired by my book, my new book, Rise Above, Free Your Mind, One Brush Stroke at a Time. And this canvas is a collaborative effort with my good friends Zhang Price and Helio Matahari. I'm staying at their place in um, Gold Coast, Australia. And last night we gathered around the coffee table with some beautiful music going and just played on the canvas. In chapter one of my book, you get to create and connect to the energy of freedom. Because who doesn't want to feel even more free in their life? Free to express what they want, free to be, free to travel, free to feel the way you want. This is one of the biggest ahas I had um, last spring when I was in Mexico on spring break with my kids and my parents and then also in Nepal. And I realized that in any given moment, we are free to feel any way we want to feel. And that I would so much rather be free to feel and move in the world the way I choose from a place of love, compassion, positive expectancy, than to spend my time worrying about creating like physical matter or tapping into kind of the how things are going to get done. So no matter what's going on outside of you, within, you can create new levels of freedom. And you can learn to recognize and create awareness around what might be keeping you feeling stuck at the canvas. So in my book, Rise Above, <clears throat> excuse me, Rise Above, Free Your Mind One Brush Stroke at a Time, the exercise in the freedom chapter is to simply go to the canvas and paint, just doodle, just, just like diverge and explore and tell yourself over and over again, I'm free to do whatever I want. I'm free to do whatever I want. I'm free to make a mistake. I'm free to put pink next to dark green. I'm free to do zigzags. I'm free to create. We weren't ever quite sure what this was. We weren't trying to, but it was so much fun to watch it evolve. It was a tornado. It was a volcano. It was a tree of life. Uh, it may be becoming a dragon. So, you know, we're used to art and painting being this like result oriented product kind of driven like I want to do it right I want it to be good type of energy what if painting became meditation what if painting became a portal for you to connect to your highest self that will connect you to a perspective that will help you rise above whatever life is sending your way and instead live life from that higher perspective, not allowing those, you know, little disturbances in your field that go on for all of us on a day-to-day -day basis to lower your vibration. So I had to share, look at all the freedom that was going on there. So tonight, what if you got out a canvas, put it in the middle of the dining room table, put on some music, and invited the family or whoever you live with to join you? Please go to riseabovethebook.com. You can pre-order your own copy. It's so gorgeous. And you'll get an instant download of the entire book. And it's magical glowing from your screen. It's the only way I've seen it up until now. And every time I read it, I just like am levitating. It's so high vibration. Also, you can go there if you want to just kind of take a peek and get a free special introduction. It's called A Taste of Freedom. And you can explore this process. So since we're talking about rising above, I'm having this chill day um, here in Australia. And look where I am. 
look at this view. So um, that's the Pacific Ocean. Sorry, you probably can't hear me. The Pacific Ocean in the distance. Gold Coast, Burley Heights, I think it's called. And um, this is a national park all around. Those are mountains created by a volcano. Um, Mount Warning is close by. I gotta show you this pond too. I'm about to get in that swimming pool after this. Um, can you see the pond down below there? There are lotus flowers blooming. Um, lotus flowers you'll paint in my book in the abundance chapter. So Rise Above is all about um, creating energy and tuning into how we prevent ourselves unconsciously from creating the energy we want. So um, it's super exciting. So go to riseabovethebook.com. You can download the free introduction. You can pre-order your copy and get the instant free download of the entire book. Um, it's so exciting. I've been writing this book for years and years. And my last book, as many of you know, um, The Artist Within, A Guide to Becoming Creatively Fit, is amazing and wonderful and it's black and white on the inside. Well, don't worry. This book is like vibrating the most amazing colors ever, full of art every single page. And um, I guarantee you, I, in fact, message me if you buy the book and you're like, Whitney, I did nothing for me. I guarantee you it will raise your vibration. So thank you all so much. You all have been the wind beneath my wings. And go to WhitneyFreya.com to join my muse letter. I am going to be um, vision questing in New Zealand, and this is where, during my travels, I kind of take you with me and do videos and tap into the symbolism and the synchronicities and coincidences that are happening. There may be a haka dance involved. <sighs> I'm hoping. And um, much more. We'll see. It's been an adventure, this Australian trip. And um, thanks for tuning in. Thanks for being a part of this community, and I so look forward to connecting with you further. Bye everyone. Riseabovethebook.com. Go check it out. There's a fun video there too. Okay? Bye. See you there.